back. We had to go straight right to Garbanzo. Oh this is gosh. so cute. We've already obsessed over her. She yes. The most beautiful piercing eyes you'll ever see. Beautiful. Can we get a close up of her sweet face? Oh, and my gosh. Um, some lucky family yeah. is going to be adding Garbanzo uh, to the mix. And boy, what a sweet dog she would be. Tell us about her. <laughs> yeah. So this is Garbanzo. She's the last in litter. All of her siblings oh, got adopted. My. I mean, come on, look at those and eyes. And she is just eight weeks old. So she's a pretty big puppy. Yeah. yeah. Um, pretty long. So I think that should probably be a medium to large breed dog. Okay. We're not oh. sure what breed. Um, her and her siblings were all found of strays. So so okay. um, we don't have any information on her parents, but all of the puppies have been really well mannered, and we got them in when they were just five weeks, and they've been in foster homes learning. Mm -hmm. And she's been sitting just like this. Yes, for learning how to minutes. socialize, yeah. and they're all been <laughs> fixed. Mix. She's very relaxed. Yeah, you can she's tell. Very relaxed. She wants to be free. <laughs> We've been snuggling her, and yes. she's been very well mannered, yeah. and without yeah. any treats. So yeah. that's a big deal. Yeah, so and so ears. she's already been fixed and given her age appropriate vaccines and preventatives. Okay. And every puppy is 350, and that includes a spay neuter age appropriate vaccines, and then a six week training. Course. Wow. So, it's really important Aww. that you adopt these puppies because they yeah. are going to good homes. <laughs> oh my God, so sweet. What would you say would be a good home for Garbanzo? Any other dogs, yeah. kids? Yeah, I think with puppies, it's always good to make sure your pet at home is already good and wants another puppy because mm -hmm. puppies are a lot of work and yes. she's super relaxed right now, but they do have that crazy puppy energy. Just being patient and get ready for some training and working with them through all their puppyhood phases because they can be really fun but they can also be a lot, a lot of a lot <laughs> yeah. of work I think yeah she sees yeah. herself in the camera <laughs> yeah. she's like I like but that. i mean look at this face yeah. look at those eyes i just we can't get over how beautiful she is so uh, it's not just garbanzo we know there are a lot of other yeah. pets mm -hmm. that are in need of a forever home just tell us more about the process yeah so you come on in we have a pretty <laughs> um open adoption process so you come on in you fill out an application you can do that online okay. or at this shelter we talk with one of our adoption counselors and we can help find you the best pet. So you might come into the shelter looking for a puppy, but then you might meet some other dogs that are really great. We have a full shelter right now full of really great dogs. So even if a puppy isn't for you, you yeah. should go and look at our other pets. And you guys have a really fun event coming up too. Yes. Tell us about that. Yeah, so Paws, Claws and Corks, it's our 12th year hosting it. It's gonna be on April 10th at DeVos Place. And you can live auction, silent auction, really good food and drinks. It's going to be a great time, and all the funds go back to us at Humane Society West Michigan. Wow. So I can't important. believe it's the 12th year already. I know. That's crazy. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Okay, well, where can we go to learn more about Garbon? So I yeah. want to take her on myself. Yes, yeah, so you can go uh, any other dog. Yeah, you go to our website, hswestmi.org, oh, or visit us on our socials at hswest. <laughs> She's that's a trance. I love it so much. Well, Zoe, <laughs> we always appreciate you. And Garbanzo, I don't think he's going to have any no, trouble at all. finding <laughs> a forever home. So sweet. Kevin, we're going to be petting uh, Garbanzo as you're doing your wedding. Is that okay?